What's up guys, this is a deck review on the Expert at the Card Table deck by B, um, designed by SW Erdnays, and I'll get more into that in just a little bit. On the front, we got the Expert at the Card Table with two little acorns on the side right there. Uh, on top, you got playing cards right there. On the back, you've got nothing, it's blank. I believe that in the first edition, it actually has the backs of the cards, like the diamond back. Um, but on this one, it doesn't, and you see SWE up there on the flap. Okay, and on the side, it's made to look like the spine of the Expert at the Card Table book by SW Erdnays. So that's basically what it is, the Expert at the Card Table, eight, two acorns right there, uh, illustrated Erdnays. So I'm hoping y'all can see that. Okay, let's get right into the deck, and basically on the bottom, you got your copyright. Um, you open up the box. And let's go ahead and show you the extra cards it comes with. So, this these would basically be them. By what I mean by extra cards is like what it, the what the deck comes with. Like here we've got the first two pages of the book, um, the expert at the card table. So that's pretty nice. I've taken time to read this. It's all right. Just the two first pages of the book. Then what you got is these perfect beautiful jokers for sandwich effects and what I mean by sandwich effects is because they are exactly the same and you can you know uh, use it as duplicates also they're really nice jokers they're simple and amazing so that's basically what the joker looks like two acorns in the middle of a shining bright light in the back I believe and your ace of spades what everybody likes to see basically it says SWE up top and then inside the spade, there's two acorns, the expert at the card table, 1902, and you got your leaf work around everything to make it look beautiful. So there it is. That's your ace of spades. Let's get right into the deck of cards itself. Let's get into the backs. The backs are green and white. Obviously, on my camera, you cannot see the green. I don't know why, but that's just the way it is. So they're green and white, and these actually have borders. Um, Bee Stingers also have borders, but they actually fade into what makes the borders. This is actually just a border deck. So I like this. It makes it easier for double lifts and whatnot. The faces themselves are exactly like your normal B uh, deck would be. You know, uh, there are your spot cards, your court cards. This is like a normal bicycle deck. So if you're familiar with that deck, I'm pretty sure everybody is. Uh, it's exactly the same thing. Not really too uh, shocking in any way. But what I like about this deck is that you can pull this out and have a spectator feel really comfortable with what deck you have and they won't feel like it's gimmicked in any way because this deck is um, so simple. But it, it is one of those amazing decks though. Uh, I don't know what the finish is on this deck but it feels really good in the hands. Let's give it a dribble to see the handling. These dribbles are great. Um, so dribble's really good. I would say the dribble would be out of a 10. I would give this an, a 9. I'm being serious about that. I am not kidding guys. One card by one card by the other fall. It's not blocked up in any way. Let's give it a spread. Well, I'm not too good at spreads, but if it spreads really good, they don't block up in any way either. Everything is separated. They go one by one. So that's real good. I would give that a 9 out of a 10 too. And a fan, what everybody likes to see. I suck at fans, um, but I would give it a 7 out of 10. Or an 8 out of 10, either or. Um, so yeah, th the fans are pretty good too on this deck. So overall, this deck, I recommend. Um, there's no reason why you shouldn't pick up a pack uh, at danandave.com. You can find them on eBay or even on... Um... No, I, I believe that's it. Like I said, guys, I... Would not, um, I would not say this deck is bad at all. Overall, I give this deck an 8 out of a 10. I really like this deck so much. It looks great and really, you know, cool to mess around with. It feels real good in the hands. So that's about all I got for you guys today. A deck review on the Expert at the Card Table deck by SW Erdnays. And um, for more deck reviews like these and more tricks, please hit that yellow button up top. And I'll be seeing you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching this. And um, take care.